Yo, what is up, guys? In this video, we have the Gold Ranger in his master mode. Um, in the master mode suit. So let's get into it. So first, to like close the box, side of the box, back of the box, it shows the morpher with the key going in it. Got a picture of him. Then we have the company logo down here, made by Hasbro's. Other side, then the front. So let's get into it. Got it. Alright, got it. Alright, got it. Alright, got it. Alright, got it. This is the master mode saver. This is the green blade and red handle. Master mode. Now this is the master mode key. Then the master mode gold ranger. So let's get into it. I've done like three times, but yeah, whatever. Uh, uh. All right, so we got him out of the packaging. So it took us forever because the cape stuck behind the packaging. But so the figure looks really good. Yeah. Second Gold Ranger, really like it. Yeah, I know. So, yeah. I wish you're on the back. So let's take a look at the accessories first. We'll stand you up back there if you'll stand. All right, I got it. So, first, we have the Dino Master Mode Saver 360 degree angle. Has a green blade, looks really good with the red handle. So, really cool, really cool. I don't, and. I don't know if he's gonna do that. Now, see, on really good, so let's put it in his hand. As far over there as you are. Let's put it in his hand real quick. Okay. So, he looks pretty good holding it. Looking good. So, we'll have you hold on to that for now. So the second thing that comes with is the key, the master mode key. Now I don't buy the morphers, so I just have a bunch of keys sitting in the um bucket because I don't buy morphers. But we still have the key. So yeah. Here's the key. Yeah. So looks really good. I really like him. So the next for the articulation. So for articulation, let's take this saver out of his hand, put it aside. Now, you won't be able to go back as much because of the cape. Like, you normally be able to rotate the arm all the way up as, as far as you can go because of the cape. Elbow still bends like it would. Yeah. And the head does not turn at all because of the cape. But that's fine. And then the legs can go all the way up. They're not hindered at all. See the position. Knees can go all the way up, turn, like that. So, looks really good. Oh, there is no ankle articulation, which that's very disappointing. Or wrist, but they has not okay. been ankle or wrist articulation on any of this Power Ranger wave. So, yeah. But, okay. looks really good, the belt looks really good, um, did a really good job on this figure, so, yeah, so let's put you in your, let's put you, give you your saber, you need that saber, don't you? Yeah, I don't know. He won't. He won't get in his stance very well. But there, there, there he is, just standing up. Or fall over. Yeah, I'll be right back with the comparisons. All right. So for the only comparison I'm doing, 
we have the Gold Ranger, the um, uh, normal Gold Ranger without any of the, without the Master Mode suit, and the one with the Master Mode suit. As you can tell, there is a difference. This one has a cape, and it comes with the Master Mode saber, whereas that one only comes with his dagger and blaster. So, that's it for comparisons. Alright, so for my final thoughts on this figure, it's a really good figure. It, now, they could have improved the articulation a little bit by making this a little bit more softer than a hard plastic. But, yeah, it looks good. It does hold position really well, so that's good. So, and then they come with a key, like always. It's really good. So, that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next one. Bye.